Hello guys, this is Alex Trevino and this is the second tutorial of the Laser Cowboy series in Blender and Substance. This video will be about modeling. This tutorial will be about the modeling basics, the UV mapping, ID mapping and how to export it to FBX. This with the objective to have the model ready to texture in Substance Painter. For modeling the cowboy laser bag, I use very simple stuff like loop cut to add lines, also extrude. I duplicate faces and again add some lines, use inset and scale. This is pretty much what I used for this model. This is the first modifier that I will use, uh, this is subdivision, I increase the number on render and put the same on the viewport and select optimal display and after that I go to the viewport display and select the wireframe to see the low resolution wireframe. Then select all faces and go to face shade smooth with that you will have a smooth mesh now i add support and upper part of the bag i add also two modifiers the first one is subdivision and the next one is solidify Now, the plane with the solidify modifier, I will add thickness and also I will check the optimal display to see the lowest wireframe. For the belt I duplicate the face and extrude the planes to make the basic forms and finally use the two modifiers that I used before, subdivision and solidify. And this is it, we have the model ready for UV mapping.
For the UV map, you need all the meshes together. For that, you can use Ctrl J. After that, you select some loops and use mark seams. You need to mark seams all over the mesh before doing the unwrapping. After that, I will make a texture. In this case, I select New and select 4K for my textures in width and height. I also give it a name to the texture and in Generate Type, I select UV Grid. And now I will go to the shape editor and add a material, a principle BSDF material. And with Ctrl T, I will add the grid texture. Then I change the viewport to see the texture and I can see that I need to do the unwrapping. So I select all the faces and click U and do the unwrapping. And here we have the first unwrap. I can see that I have uh, some distortion so I will add more seams. And again, I will do another unwrap. Now the unwrapping seems a lot better. For the ID mapping, first you need to go to Vertex Paint and select by faces. Then choose a color, a face, then click L to select all of it and Shift K to apply the color. You need to do this all over the mesh, selecting different meshes with different colors. Now we have the ID mapping complete. First select the mesh, then select File, Export, FBX. In the Export FBX options, check Select Object. Also check Mesh. Keep the Apply modifiers and remove anything else. After that, give a name to your file and export FBX. So, in summary, this tutorial was about modeling, UV mapping, ID mapping, and how to export the mesh to FBX. And now, we have the model ready to texture in Substance Painter. I have uh, some free assets and also paid ones. The free pack includes a clay render and the laser cowboy bag ready to texture, this last one. The limited pack includes a mapped scene, so you can texture it in Substance Painter. The complete pack that includes everything that I told you before, and also five materials made in Substance Painter. So, if you like the video, please subscribe. The next video is going to be about texturing in Substance Painter.